hallucinations are getting worse. When I was fighting Topaz, do you know who I saw? I saw Madame Kokolia standing at the other end of the ring, summoning blades of ice aimed at me. I guess so. I don't think this is just some simple culture shock issue. coming up, so there won't be any fights. Luca, you can use this chance to rest and recuperate. Uh, I do need a break. I'm not actually an Iron Man or anything. Speaking of which, Pitch Dark Hook the Great, what are you doing here on your own? Where'd Svarog go? Well, Svarog said he needed to do some data sampling. He asked Hook to wait for him here and not disturb Luca. Hook has been a goodie and waiting here alone. Data sampling? <sighs> Forget it. It's not something I should be worrying about. Coach, I think I need to get my symptoms looked at. But where can I see a doctor on the Xianzhou? Please, if you don't mind. <sighs> I hope they're as good as Natasha. do again? A simple explanation would be that they are the information technology department on the Sienjo. They are mainly responsible for predicting the future. Predicting the future? I guess they're kind of a big deal. At first I thought she was a little awkward, but I guess she just uh, doesn't like socializing. What should we do first? See a doctor or go to the divination commission? I agree. If the hallucinations are getting bad, we should see a doctor sooner rather than later. I wanna go too! I wanna go too! What did Sparog say? Pitch Dark Hook the Great isn't allowed to disturb Luca. But this lounge is so small and boring. I can't show off my moves in a tiny place like this. Then, Pitch Dark Hook the Great, shall I take you to our room alley to eat yummy food? Have you ever eaten a song lotus cake that chirps? I've never eaten it before. What's that? If I can taste this sun blotter's cake, I'll... Uh, I'll make you the mole's grand captain of gourmet discovery! Thank you, Pitch Dark Hook the Great! Let's set off right now. <sighs> Miss Carmella is such a kind person. She could get along with Hook so quickly. Okay, Coach. We should get going, too. Whoa! This is the Alchemy Commission? This whole place is a hospital? Can it get any bigger than this? Wow, cutting edge medicine. You must really be something to bring me straight here to get treated. You, Patrick, should do the trick. No, oh, isn't that Miss Sushong? What's she doing here? Mm. 
Miss Susong, what a coincidence! I guess you have a problem too? What sort of greeting is that? You're the one with the problem. Sorry, sorry. I mean, are you here to see a doctor too? No, I came here to help my Cloud Knight co-workers get medication for their bruises and swelling. Sorry, I went too hard on him. It was a fair match, so no one's to blame. Actually, we should be grateful to you. They were so impressed by your abilities that they said they wanted to train harder. <laughs> we meet again. Who is this beside you? Hello, I'm Luca, a friend of hers. I'm from Bellabog and a contestant in the current war dance. The bog. Apologies, I'm not familiar with the name. Regardless, welcome to the law firm, Mr. Luca. Are you here for a consultation? Uh, this might sound weird. Interesting. Hmm. Let's run an imaging test first to confirm that your brain has no organic issues. A fighter's bound to run into such problems. Huh? What's it got to do with anything organic? I thought mechanical parts were fine in the tournament. Uh, not that organic. It means, uh... Oh, how do I explain this? It means that the brain is broken. Huh? The brain is... broken? But don't worry. Now that you're at the Alchemy Commission, I'll do my best to find a solution. Hold still and don't move. Three, two... One... Cheese! We're not taking a photo. Hmm. Cauldron Master, what do you see? Is there any hope for me? a huge shadow in his brain. Could it be? <laughs> I'm too young to die, Dark. I'll do it. I'll stay positive and defeat the demons of this illness. Uh, that shadow looks a lot like my hand. You are still making the V sign. I told you it's not a photo. From the exam results, it looks like there's nothing wrong with your brain. Mr. Luca, have you been eating anything unusual lately? Let me think. I ate some of the local delights when I got here. Song lotus cake, chili oil beef offal stew, scale gourd spring water, mung bean soda, spicy diced chicken, garlic infused pork. After the tournament officially started, my diet has been pretty much the same. Brown rice, corn, buckwheat, boiled chicken breast, boiled beef shank, poached fish, boiled prawns. Uh, are we feeding livestock here? Mr. Luca, don't be afraid to tell me. Is she mistreating you? I will make sure you get justice. <laughs> of course not. I have to watch what I eat during a match. I can't be stuffing myself with junk. Your appetite astounds me. But it seems you didn't eat anything that might affect your brain. Oh, right! After the match with Miss Sushang, I drank a bottle of Sweet Dream Soda. But I think I was already hallucinating before that? Sweet Dream Soda. I think I understand what's going on. It's not unusual to be anxious when you're far away from home. When your nerves were thrown into disarray, the sweet dream soda you drink intensified it. That drink has a fair amount of memoria in it, intended to make dreams more vivid and pleasant, but instead it caused your anxiety to be amplified, eventually triggering serious hallucinations. Sorry, I didn't understand a word you just said. It's all right. There's no cure for such a symptom. What I mean is that you don't require medication. Just stroll around the Lafu more and take in the barrage of new sights and sounds. Stop drinking Sweet Dream Soda and your symptoms will disappear in a few days. 
Stroll around the Lofu more. Don't drink Sweet Dream Soda. Okay, I've got it memorized. I'm suddenly reminded of something that might help alleviate your symptoms. Please wait a moment. Something that can help alleviate my symptoms? Lady Lingsha said that these medical patches are very effective, but we're fighting again tomorrow. Will it be enough? Sure, but we've been revived. You guys didn't know? The war dance has a popularity revival rule. If eliminated contenders or teams garner enough popularity votes in online polls, they can participate in the repechage and re-enter the ring. So, Miss Susang's team is really popular then. <laughs> it's all mainly thanks to my good friend, Lil Gwei. All she has to do is tap a finger on the internet, and our popularity votes will blast through the roof like a comet. You know what I mean. Anyway, it's all thanks to Lil Gwei's hard work that I, Su Shang, am back in the fight. Ah, <laughs> not bad at all. A friend that you can rely on is the most blissful thing in the world. Mr. Luca, come take a look. This is the tusk fur treatment that I've prepared for you. Wow, what is it? Touch it, touch it! Oh, that's too cute! You're just like a strawberry bun! I can't stay rational in the face of such cuteness. This is a tusker of the Sienjo Juming. Warm, sweet, not for consumption. Oh, it's pretty cute. But how can it make me better? The tusker is a creature that subsists on memoria. Hugging it while you fall asleep can raise your sleep quality, treat insomnia, and relieve anxiety and depression. Tusper loves strong memoria. The more depressed you are, the more happy it'll be. Isn't that right, little fella? Meg. Meg. Sounds great. Uh, how much? <sighs> Don't worry. This Tusper is a personal pet of mine. I can lend it to you for this treatment, but you have to take good care of it for me. Oh, I can't thank you enough. All throughout my journey, I've received so much help from the Alliance. I will definitely repay everyone. Um, oh, you two! You guys have something important to attend to later, right? It must be awfully tiring lugging this cutie pie around, right? 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 Stop staring at me with those weary eyes. You all go take care of your stuff. I'm about to head back to the Sky Splitter to deliver some meds to the team. As a Cloud Knight, I always help out and do at least one good deed a day. I can take this tusk fur to the lounge for you. I'll just hold it for a bit. I swear her. I won't steal it. That's fine by me, Miss Sushang. You can also come play with it anytime you want. Oh, yeah! Thank you, Mr. Luca. Come here, cutie. <laughs> Adorable little tusky, you're so cute. I could just gobble you right up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's acting just like Zela did the first time she saw a real plains bear. Looks like the tusk bear not only regenerates rationality, it also destroys it. <sighs> make for an interesting research topic. If there's nothing else I can do for the both of you, I'll be on my way. Thank you for the Tuskmer. I will treasure it and shower it with love. Oh, we were delayed at the Alchemy Commission. Hope we didn't keep Lynx and the Master Diviner waiting too long. <laughs> <laughs> 